you're here. It's been a week. Yeah. What's the best of it? What has been the best of it? I think the best of it has been uh, uh, the openness. What's the worst part? Well, the worst part is we have a whole bunch of systems in place now. We know we're going to have to change them. And you can't do it like tomorrow. PIX11 met up with new NYCHA CEO Greg Ross at the Wrangell House's Family Day in Washington Heights Saturday. What do you think of this new, new boss? Oh, this is the godfather right here. <laughs> this is the godfather. I love him. We wanted to find out how he's settling into his new job. We have a lot of work to do inside. We've got to deal with the piping. We've got to deal with the water. And um, and at the same time, look around. These are the towers in the park. So how do you fix that building without maybe uh, taking that character away from it. When PIX11 last spoke with Russ, it was in Minneapolis, where he was in charge of 6,300 apartments. Now he's in charge of 175,000. He's now getting his first look inside NYCHA. The last time I talked to you, it, you hadn't seen NYCHA. What do you think now? We do have, um, we have the aging issues of the units, no doubt. The buildings uh, are in, uh, uh, their bones are good. Russ visited developments all across the city this week, mostly away from cameras. NYCHA's Twitter pinned to the top is this quote from Russ, promising in the first 100 days real and substantial change, restoring trust and becoming a more accountable landlord. He said 100 days. Well, 100 days would be let's roll out what we think we can get our hands around very quickly. And, uh, but there's got to be a long play strategy. As for his boss, Mayor Bill de Blasio, he says he's in constant contact with him. Met with the mayor, um, talked to him several times. We, you know, we have a good relationship. I'm very pleased, and uh, he understands why I'm here. Building back trust and listening—that's what some residents say they're looking for in a new NYCHA CEO, and to deliver on promises to fix things. One key thing he said is he wanted to stay up to respect us. Tenants. Something I've been fighting for for years. In Washington Heights, Monica Morales, PIX11 News.